Come on, the ladies. Let's go. Now just the fellas. Now just silent. Yeah, that's what I thought. Anyway, that's no jokes. All right. So I think that uh, the ability to accept change is really, you know, a defining characteristic of what makes a person great, right? Why I don't look down on homeless people. <laughs> I'm lying. I'm lying. I'm 5'10", they're always on the ground. Of course I'm looking down on them. <laughs> and they don't have a home on top of that, or a job or money, so I'm doing it again, morally. It's three times. I'm sorry. I've broken your trust. Alright. So, I got $200 in Amazon gift cards. Um, which I told my girlfriend about, and I shouldn't have done that because it got me in trouble. It's gonna get me in trouble again. Uh, so I waited a while, and then I spent it all in an hour flat. So I call her. I'm like, "Yeah, I spent on the Amazon money. I was super excited." She goes, "You spent all that money in an hour? Whoa. Uh, yeah. How did you spend two hundred dollars in an hour? I mean, first of all, you've been to a mall, right? Amazon.com is pretty much just a mega mall, but instead of walking in and going, "Oh man, where do I start?" I can go directly to whatever item I feel. And because I'm a male, yes, no, it took me an hour. And she's like, <laughs> she's like, oh, okay. Give me your password and email address so I can log in and check your stuff. I was like, all right, fine. So you text it, calls me back. You spent $20 on a grinder? I was like, yeah. yeah? You know you could have went up the street and got one, right? I was like, okay, now it's, it's, first of all, this is not real money. If it was real money, I'd be buying weed. Second of all, <laughs> You spend that same amount of money to paint your nails. You make the proteins that grow out of your fingers look pretty for that amount of money. That's $20 every two weeks times that by 26. That's $520 a year on finger paints. Are you a teenage girl or one of those fancy preschools with parents and their kids that are getting to Yale? Hint, not the second one. You'd be full of way more valuable information. <laughs> She's here. I'm in trouble. Don't look around. Don't look around. It's awkward. Don't do it. Uh, no, uh, yeah, so I got it as a care package for getting into college because it's like, oh wow, you're black, you're into college, you deserve things. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, it takes six years to get a master's. Six years, right? I'm just being black and already having a master. <laughs> now I have to work for one. Well, before I had to. <laughs> no, so, um, okay, I know, alright, alright, I'm crossing lines, right? Slavery is not funny. <laughs> it's a bit funny, it's a little funny. No, because, okay, listen, because, let's be objective here, right? You're sitting around with your copper tone tribe around a fire, dancing for rain, not much has changed, stripper joke, keep up. Um, and then, these people just come, like, you don't know what's going on, it's like a ghost apocalypse. <laughs> just rains upon you and they just take you like, hey, uh, you wanna go on the shittiest cruise? Uh, it's a one-way thing, so, well, I have to check the returning availability. No, 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 this is not, this is not a choice. Look, we found this land, it was already full of brown people, we got rid of them. Uh, it's a little, it's a little unkempt, we don't wanna get our knickers dirty. <laughs> Dirty knickers. Has a nice ring to it. Uh, and uh, so you're gonna come, and uh, you're pretty much just gonna make this place gonna prosper for us. Uh, well, uh, do we get a cut? Probably a few lashes here and there. No, no, no. I meant, do we get like some of the money? Oh, oh. No. Uh, no. This is no. You will not. Oh, I mean, maybe hundreds of years from now, you can. So we work for you for hundreds of years. Correct. And then we split it 50-50? <laughs> God, no, no, no. This is not something that is 50-50. At most, this becomes 85, 15, and nah, being generous. <laughs> so, uh, so then what's in it for me? Well, um, uh, what's your religion? Well, we, uh, we pray to the sun when it comes up, bathe in this river. Oh, uh, no, 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 I have a Bible. This is your truth now. Uh, you can go two places when you die, either heaven or hell. Heaven is awesome, full of civilized people, and hell is hot. And probably full of views, a lot like Africa. Uh, but if you work hard enough for us, you can go to this heaven place. And black people at first were a bit resistant, but what makes it hilarious is that we've completely fallen for it. Like, if, like black people at their most, like during the civil rights movement, while we were fighting for like freedom against the white man, we we're just going back to their establishment 
that they gave you to keep you a slave. You can be like, oh Lord Jesus, please let these white men be master men. <laughs> and that Jesus is his Jesus that he wrote down. He's just like, <laughs> Say it. Guys, listen to rap music. Push a T. No, alright. The light's not on yet, so I have more jokes to tell. Cool, I'm having fun. Uh, okay, so, there it is. Alright. <laughs> Let me get this out of the way. So, um, 100 Cars for Good is a charity that donates cars for good. Um, and I saw them post a picture on my Facebook, it was an advertisement, and it's like, this girl who's in a uh, motorized wheelchair being unloaded from her car. And it's like, here is seen Sarah going bowling with her friends. Thanks to 100 Cars for Good. Have a nice time, Sarah. And I was like, that's a waste of money. Not keeping her alive. I meant the one bowling. Because we all know she isn't the one bowling, right, guys? Like, she, it's her friends, those moochers. And also, also, do they break out bowling tires? <laughs> no. Why then? It's going to void the warranty. And me and you both look at having a car donated to you. You are not financially stable enough to keep going bowling enough for those wheels to turn a profit. Come on. She's just a cripple. <laughs> <laughs> I was Carlos. Thank you. <laughs>